Pope Benedict XVI met with four Holocaust survivors who expressed their gratitude to the church for saving their lives during World War II. As Jewish-German teenagers during the 1930s, they fled to Italy and found moral and material support from the Catholic Church. We, uh, Jewish people from ma mainly Germany uh, and Austria, nobody came for a few years until an emissary from the Pope was sent to us who gave us not only moral support, he gave us hope. Uh, it was a, which I should say, basically our salvation because that gave us the courage uh, to keep on living and going forward. This woman and her family were saved by the personal commitment of Monsignor Benjamino Schifo, at the time the young rector of a local seminary in Umbria. He is now 97 years old and has been honored as righteous among nations in the Holocaust Memorial of Yad Vashem in Jerusalem. My mother and I were hidden in a convent in, in the, of the Sacred Heart in Chiari Castello, dressed as nuns, locked into a room. This the Monsignor did for us. My father was hidden about eight hours away in the country with a farmer. And we were in that convent until the British Eighth Army liberated us. And if I'm here today, it's to thank Italy, the nuns who saved my life, the clergy, and one person. The visit was a reminder of the efforts of Pope Pius XII in saving the Jews during the Holocaust. If anybody ever thinks that the Pope could do anything against Hitler. What did he have? His 22 Swiss guards? He wants to fight the German army, which took the whole world to do? Impossible. He did what he could do, and he stank, and he saved many, many people, and for this we all should be thankful to. The visit was sponsored by the Pave the Way Foundation, which is preparing a symposium on the papacy of Pius XII in September to collect and publish the hidden solidarity stories of the dark days of the Holocaust.